our story for today, Mary has just learned from the angel Gabriel that she is about to have a baby. And we see here the very next thing she does, which is that she runs to her cousin Elizabeth's house. I love this story because it just feels very real. When I've talked about this story before, I have sometimes said that Mary runs to Elizabeth to tell her the good news, but I'm not sure that that's true. The news that Mary has just received is shocking. And when she runs to Elizabeth's house, Mary doesn't say anything. It's Elizabeth who speaks. It's Elizabeth who exclaims blessings and joy. Only then does Mary sing. I find that this is often the case, that big news, good or bad, it needs friends before we can sing about it. In these years of distance, I think we're learning this is even more true. We need each other to proclaim blessing and joy in order that we might come to see the joy too. I've learned a lot about wombs leaping this year, and I keep learning that in the joy and in the hard parts, it's better when we get to journey it together. And so who might you need to remind today of the blessing and the joy? And who are you giving thanks for, for reminding you of the same?